Welcome back there, you guys. Thank you so very much for waiting. I feel like that song's incredibly loud compared to the rest of the soundtrack. I'll turn that down just a smidge. Um, welcome back. I hope you all had a good break and welcome on into anyone who may have joined us while we were on our break. Uh, we are currently day nine of winter year three. Uh, and our main objective right now actually is getting down to the bottom of the mines without using the elevator because it's broken right now. Um, has ACNH lived up to your expectations? Uh, in so many ways it surpassed it, in other ways it didn't quite, but it's still a really good game. <laughs> in some ways it did, in some ways it did not. But for the most part, it did really good. I literally just finished brushing off my microphone, Kiara, please. <laughs> I lint rolled my desk, I lint rolled my microphone, I lint rolled myself. Um, please don't get more, mic or more cat hair everywhere. <laughs> okay. Um, so this goes in here. And Kiara, are you licking the lint bro? Please don't. <laughs> you're gonna get your tongue stuck to it and then you're gonna freak out. I have been here in a while, I'm about to school last Tuesday. I got started just after the one year anniversary of ACNH. Uh, and got so stuck. Or sucked in, maybe. I completed a year and a half in nearly five days. You got any good tips? I stopped playing for a while, but I'm back playing since Saturday. I'm in winter year two. You're probably doing really good, um, honestly, if, if you've gotten in that far. What are you what are you working on in game right now? Hey, dirty paws. Yeah, we switched Stardew and Nino Cooney. Um so that my throat can have a bit of a rest uh, when I have my day off on Friday. Uh, just because Nino Kuni has been absolutely murder on my uh, on my throat. <laughs> Unfortunately. Sorry for the cat tail. <laughs> but it smells like me. <laughs> oh goodness me. My cats. This morning Ollie was uh we have a cat water fountain. In the, in the living room and he was splashing in it because he likes to play with water for some reason. And he um, he got upset at himself because he like splashed it a little bit too hard and it kind of got him in the face. It was very funny to watch though. <laughs> Stardew is very chill, yeah. So I think it's it's a perfect time to, to play it. Four chickens, two cows so far and I'm only discovering that little cave has mushrooms, yeah. Um, Pigs are a really good way to earn some money uh, if you go down that route. Um, you might need an upgraded barn for them though. And what else? I don't know if you've been checking the traveling merchant, but that's something really good if you're still working on completing the community center. Kara, are you getting stuck in cables? Please don't. <laughs> Rain so much on my ACNH island. It's been a big help for hybrids. It also creates so many unwanted flowers. Yeah. I love that, you know, we can get hybrids really easily that way. But it is also kind of low key a bit of a pain. Yeah, seed maker, I've got star fruit. Yes, yep. Seed makers are really, really good. I'm glad they're enjoying it so much, though. Stardew is really great. No, no, sausage, go away. Uh, I guess that doesn't go in there. There we go. Okay. <laughs> Sorry, try to get used to- we, we only recently just moved our, uh... Kiara, oh my god. Our, um... Our makers inside. I'm still getting used to my new little routine here. Santa with that four month uh, resub, thank you. I really do appreciate that. I hope things have been good for you today and in general. Okay, are you gonna climb up back there? You're gonna fall and you're gonna regret that. Is that what we're doing? Oh, I'm being used as a step ladder. All right, all right. You can you can go up there, but don't get mad at me when you get stuck and can't get down. She's gonna jump back over here, isn't she? Please don't land on my on my water. Oh, big jumps. <laughs> hey, Mads World, how's it going? What are you doing? What are you doing? Are you are you really trying to get my attention that badly? Okay, animals taken care of. 
we're going mining again. And we have bombs this time, so hopefully we get down a bit, a bit faster. She's just all over the place. She's just, she's chaotic today. I don't know why. She's probably upset because I have the window open. And it's slightly chilly in here. She does not like the cold. Okay, so we made it down to floor 15. Floor 20 is going to be one of those obnoxious floors, unfortunately. No claws in the microphone. You know better. You know better. <laughs> Gotta love some chaos. She's been around Ollie too much. Maybe. I constantly have to adjust this. My microphone arm, I swear. It breaks, Kiara. There's our first stairway down of the day. Always a good sign. Let's see our second one already. Oh, there's another one of those weird squid things. I wonder what else they drop. Squid ink, okay, that makes sense. I work plugging away. That's good to me. Okay, they actually do hurt a bit. Ooh, you drop gold bars too. I need those. Uh, guild quest for the monsters. Has nothing to do with the key quest. I'm not sure you'll find the last monster. Ooh, okay. I really wonder because you know, I've done so much in this game. It feels weird that I may have missed something. What are you. What did you just. Stop it. <laughs> oh, god, those things are weird. Been like this past week and a half. Got to be in my face eating my yarn. He decided my necklace is a toy. Oh no. <laughs> oh dear. I wonder why. I wonder why. Just choosing chaos. I need to- I'm glad I have cheese with me. Show your monsters, I can give you a hint. Yeah, for sure. Um, remind me when I'm leaving the mines if I don't leave too late, okay? Because I think I can only access that from the guild, right? The flying squid, I think so. <gasps> oh, lucky! Floor 19. Stairway right away, that's awesome. Alright, floor 20, that's not too bad. We just have a hundred more. <laughs> There's also more of this, uh radioactive ore, which I'm very, very interested in. Oh, nice. <laughs> oh god, okay, 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 don't pack, don't pack, don't pack, don't pack. We're fine, we're fine, it's fun. Okay, that was a little bit scary, but I got some swords from it for some reason. <laughs> How long are these mines? Are you just trying to get new stuff? These are uh, 120 floors. 120 floors, and we have to get down to the bottom uh, in a week. We doing all right? No worries about the response. That's all good. I'm glad that things are going good. Drop rice shoots. Yeah, it's kind of weird that that's what they drop, isn't it? Oh, that's the stairway right there. I was about to bomb, but that's good. Stone laying around, you can make those stairwells. Yeah, that would also be a really good idea. I hate using my materials for that stuff, but I know that would... Like, if we get to, like, the end of the week and I get to, like, floor 80, that would be a good idea. I'm also curious to see if he mentions that I don't use stairs to get down, Mr. Key, because he definitely did when we went to... Um, whatever floor it was of the Skull Cavern. But I was also using that elevator mod that he doesn't know about, so... <laughs> yeah, the slimes look really neat. Oh, 
Oh, I got rid of its shell. You're so cute. I feel bad getting rid of its shell like that. In case I need to bail out of a floor. Yeah, that's probably a good idea. Oh, you can. What do you think is the fastest way to make money? I've been uh, going mad making mayo and cheese. Um, so artisan stuff definitely is the way to go. Um, it's good that you're doing that. Um, wines. So eventually uh, you'll be able to make uh, various wines um, using some of your crops. So I use ancient fruit. Um, and you can age that as well to get it even higher quality and sell more. Um, crystallariums eventually, if, if you really want to, although I don't think they're as good as kegs and wine. Oh god, there's so many of you guys here. <laughs> this is kind of a weird chase. There we go. This is such a weird enemy. There we go. I love that they drop gold bars though, because we, we need those desperately. Um, but another thing in terms of money making, um, knowing what crops are best for which season. Um, so strawberries for summer, I think, usually, if you can't get those, then potato. Uh, cranberries, blueberries, uh, those are the main things. Okay, we're gonna make it down to floor 30. At least. My inventory. Oh, it is. Okay. It's kind of funny because, like, the layouts of the floors are the same for the most part. Um, but definitely the monsters and, like, just the look of it is different. There we go. There's our stairs. Shoot, go away. It's also good that they're dropping so many bombs for me. Has anyone in here actually, by the way, has anyone in here done any uh any challenge runs for Stardew? Ever like try to get the community center in a year or done anything like that? Because I haven't. I usually just start a new save file. Say I'll do a JoJo run and then I don't. <laughs> hey, all the girls going good. How's yours going? That one repeats too, yeah. Then no crops on Ooh, that's interesting. So were you uh, doing a lot of fishing, I guess? Early game, and then like... Mining for gems? Maybe. Press the show, plant coal or ore. How do you complete it? So you need to go into the mines usually and uh, actually collect what he's asking for. And then you can go up to him with that in your inventory, I think, and show it to him. Just talk to him and he should accept it. Fruit tree. Oh yeah, fruit tree is one barn, one coop. A few houses with crystallariums. A coal twice on skull floor. It'd be sad, yeah. So here's the darker floors. Should have done that a bit higher up. It's cool that these all just look slightly different as well. I was wondering if they were all gonna look the same. You can get key gems from in here? 
Oh. That changes some things. Slaughter, yeah, on floor 40. I know the one. Oh god. Oh god, that's cheese. <laughs> I was trying to attack them with cheese. There we go. Uh, so I think we're gonna be able to go to floor 35 here. And that's that's pretty good. Throw the cheese. <laughs> oh, you don't want to give me the elevator? Or the stairs, sorry. There we go. Usually these floors are the ones I try to get through as fast as possible because I don't like them. hard enough. <laughs> Floor 35. So I don't think the thing is still open. I think it closes at like yeah, 10, unfortunately. Chest still on the chest floor, but sadly auto is crazy to find. Yeah. Yeah, I've I've heard of, of doing that. I do have the key to the city. Is he oh like is he still behind the desk right now? I forgot about that, actually. <laughs> Low-key. Okay, so these ones are all good. Um, it was one of... I think it... It can't have been the mu I hadn't actually beat a mummy. I hadn't actually beat a mummy. That was the issue. I only beat them now because I have a sword that can actually destroy them without using bombs. That was it. So because I hadn't defeated them, I had seen them. I just hadn't beat them. That makes sense. So we just need the serpents and these guys and then that quest is done. Actually, wait a minute. While I'm here. Uh... Oh. Yeah! <laughs> Thank you! Yeah, I, I just- I never wanted to waste my bombs on them. I never bothered. That makes sense. Um... Okay, let's, uh, let's go put away everything. We're getting stone from doing this, so I don't really mind. Rex is annoying. Hope for dinos. They're, uh... The first time I encountered them, I think I, I had a full floor of them, and it was just- it was super intimidating. Why do I have a yam? I have some ray shoots. Okay. Just sell those off. I'm in no rush for those. Or no need, sorry. Poor Penny. I've literally just been spending like 99% of my day out and uh, in the mines. Once their farm grows as big as the dinosaurs in the mines. That would be kind of cool. They would overshadow the other things in the coop, but I'd still be here for it. Satisfying putting the weight items like that. I always, I've re only recently gotten used to using that button, but it's a really, really handy one. Go to town today. All right, sounds good. Uh oh, she's back. The trees aren't even over there. You know exactly where they are. They're not there anymore. Oh, 
<laughs> Alrighty. So we're slowly building up our uh, ancient fruit seed collection because we're working on another ancient fruit farm on the island here. My preserve jars might actually be done. I just realized I never go over there to check on them. But I should because they're just they're slightly off screen. From where I usually run by. Oh, okay. <laughs> uh yeah, see they're done. Not that, you know, we have a lot of these yet, but Keep the cheese that we got. I will sell that. Also, um, do we have any Stardew players who play on mobile? I already own Stardew on like everything else, <laughs> um, but I have to admit I'm a little bit curious how how mobile works and if you like it or not, because I've seen some screenshots of it online. It looks interesting. But I think it'd be really great for uh, if I'm ever out waiting somewhere and I don't want to have my Switch with me. I've played mobile before, but PC is my preferred way to play. Yeah. I can I can see why. It just has a lot of uh, pluses to it. Do you play on mobile? Do you like it? Start on the Tesla apparently comes through the car. What a bargain. <laughs> Imagine trying to play and drive. I, I guess you technically don't have to be driving, but probably still should be paying attention. Uh, Alright, back to the mines. Back to the mines. It's the same way the main two differences are touchscreen movement, and you can save. Saving whenever you want is very interesting. I guess that makes sense, especially for a mobile game. You know, if you're playing in like a doctor's office or something and you have to get up. Okay, 35 onwards. Okay, for a few minutes longer till I have to go to an appointment, but I wanted to know what happened to the mines. Uh, so we're doing a, uh, I'll actually show you, a key quest called Dangers in the Deep right now, or Danger in the Deep. We have seven days a week to get through the mines. Um, the elevator system has been broken or reset, so we have to go down and get it working again. And during that time, this mine looks entirely different, has different enemies, uh, different items. And uh, it's kind of cool. It's kind of cool. I think it might be one of my new favorite quests. I found my computer was broken, but it was difficult once I started to upgrade my tools. It's hard to get to recognize that as pressing and holding. Oh yeah, to charge up tools. I think that my head got a little bit sunburned. Oh no, that's the worst. Especially like brushing your hair when you have a sunburnt head. Ugh. I know so many floors every day. Yeah, I pretty much am trying to get through as many as I can each day. Oh. of enemies here. Oopsie. Level 100 Skull Cavern. Yes, yeah, that is another one. That's another one. Uh, 
I have the elevator mod, so we kind of cheesed it a bit, but it was fun. A bit sore. Also having a shower if your head's burnt. Oh, yes. <laughs> yeah, like washing your hair. That's never fun. some new bombs at some point with how uh, I'm going through them. Oh, that's such a pretty floor. I love that. We're just full of food and Pringles were on sale. Rosie, enjoy those Pringles. There's grass in here. This is the coolest quest in the world. This is so pretty. Oh, are those giant mushrooms? <laughs> oh my god. What are you? guys. Uh-oh. Okay, that one's gonna turn into something. What do you turn into? Oh, is that a wasp? Or like a bee? Yeah, these guys like to stay on me. Starter Goombas? <laughs> I wanna hug the wall. <laughs> this is so different because this is usually like the icy looking area. How cool is this? There's trees? Can I, like... Wow. I just got hardwood in the mines and it's not from a barrel for once. I kind of don't want to use a bomb in here. This is the new update. This is the new update. Yeah, this isn't a mod or anything. This is so neat. I got an ancient seed. Uh... Oh, there's so many enemies here. <laughs> yeah, the mushrooms are usually- ooh, is this gonna- what's gonna- is it bats? Oh, it's just bats. All right, not so fun. Very pretty update. And yeah, the update, like, Concerned Ape went above and beyond. <laughs> and this is why I will continue to buy Stardew on like so many different platforms. Like just willingly. Sticks can be enemies too, really? Okay. I'll keep an eye out for the sticks, thank you. I don't want to leave that. Like, can we just have the mines like this permanently, maybe? Oh, there's like a full hardwood tree down here. Sticks. <laughs> Not the stick. Okay, just go down. Just keep going. I know you want to I I really want to stay, but... Oh, just keep moving. <laughs> By one guy. Yeah. And the, the updates have been free. Absolutely. Like, you know... I paid like, what, 16, 18 Canadian for this game? Uh, five, five years ago? Whenever it came out. Four, maybe. Year four, I'm still having a hard time getting Ancient Seed. Yep, so honestly, once you get your first one, um, I feel like they kind of just come rolling in. It's just luck, honestly, at that point. Unfortunately. Um, I think I usually get mine from mining, but... Can you get one from fishing? You might be able to. The sticks I walk past. Let's go see. Come here. Come. Come on. Wait, you don't charge at all for the awesome new content they make. Yeah. Uh, those look normal at least. Is, is that? Oh, that's just iron. Okay. Or not. <laughs> it's okay. I'm sure we'll find them. Knowing my luck. Oh, 
Like, this doesn't even feel like the same mines anymore, you know? Oh. Like, I'm, I'm kind of hoping that, you know, if we finish this quickly, like before the end of the week, we can just come back down to this floor. Because <laughs> it's so nice. phone and my ps4 yeah i uh i have it on switch and ps4 pc as well and i'm very strongly con uh considering phone you know what give me a second i think i need to take a screenshot anyway so i don't think i've taken one yet for this area or for um there we go uh for this episode when we upload it to YouTube, so. I got your PC too. This is failing some of her classes. School's not been helping her. Even when she turns in her work, she gets zero. It's happened with my friend's sister. It's mostly frustrating since the school's not helping at all. And she's handing it on time? And like done properly? And she's still getting a zero? Ooh, you look like a... Uh, uh, Ghostbuster ghost. I don't know if it had a name. I'm assuming it did. Oh, are there spider? Oh, there's spiders. There's the spider friends. Oh, they're bouncy spiders. Go on, go away. <laughs> Suddenly not all right. All right. Let's see. Let's try to make it to 55. There's like spider webs and stuff you can cut through too. That's kind of. Oh, that dropped like torches. <laughs> oh, yeah, start on everything too. Katari, have a good rest of your day. Oh, no way. I need that. I absolutely need old bars. Come in really big numbers. Yeah. It's like the sheer quantity of the enemies here that's kind of a little bit nerve-wracking. Oh, I think that slime was stuck in a spider web. Did I see that right? Come here, stop it. <laughs> I barely remember it, so the other day when I watched it, it's really not a good movie. Like, the song is cool, but the rest is so confusing. The jokes are really dated. Yeah, I think I think that's the main thing. It's it's been dated horribly, which you know is fine. But it wasn't my favorite movie. When I watched it, that's for sure. Uh, I have lots of slime. There we go. My favorite track in the game. It's one of mine too. It's really nice, isn't it? Oh, there's our stairs. Okay, fifty-five. That's pretty good. I think that was, was that 20, 20 levels today? Hey, Freaky Spirit, how are you doing? Okay, well now that I know that uh, the, the guy in the Adventurer's Guild is behind the counter still, uh, even at this time of night, I can go and take in a whole bunch of stuff here because I have a whole lot to sell. Wait a minute. That's what this button... What button? What button? What happened? Oh, you mean this one? Add to exist... Yes. <laughs> Maybe? Yeah, you put everything away. Yeah, it's handy. <laughs> I think Mike told me I should be using it, and I, like, I hadn't yet, so... Yeah, it's handy. I'm playing this game. 
game so wrong. <laughs> it definitely makes everything a lot faster. I totally just headbutted that demon with my horse. Okay. So. 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 I'm gonna keep one. Just because they're kind of neat. Uh, so. I'll get rid of the weapons. I kind of want to, like, I want to keep the rings. Because, like, what if I want to combine them, you know? I probably won't. But, like, what if? Get rid of the small magnet rings. Uh. I probably don't need that many of those. <laughs> um. Or that many of that. Oh, Rosie, I hope that you uh, enjoy that nap and sleep better tonight for sure. And keep rings in the dresser. Can you actually? That's good to know. I'll throw the ones that I, I decided to keep in there. Okay. I've been getting so many of those those rings, so don't mind this at all. I don't get like how people nap, like seriously how? I uh I can nap, but I wake up cranky as anything. I have a headache, I'm disorientated, I'm just I'm not a happy camper, so I don't <laughs> generally if if I say I'm going for a nap, I'm not feeling good at all. Does he ever want to combine them? Yeah. I remember one time. Uh, I don't think I've actually told you guys about this. Uh, this is pretty early on into New Horizon being out, and I was big in the in the stock market, you know, buying and selling turnips. And uh, I think it was Titus. Uh, he was doing a stream where he had good prices in his town, so he was letting people in. And I wanted to stay up and wait for him to go live, but I was super tired. So I took a nap. <laughs> and then I woke up and, like... Um... I think I told Mike to, like, go to Titus's town for me. And just, like, you know, be me for a bit, because I was so out of it. And, uh, I think... Mike had some trouble connecting or doing something. He didn't know how to go over to Titus's town. And um, I got so angry at him. I was so just like <laughs> cranky and irritable and just like, how could you not know how to do this for a game that just came out? How dare you? <laughs> Black curtains, a fuzzy blanket, and a fan, yeah. You're supposed to only do for yeah no i heard that if you do too much you you go into too deep a sleep and then you wake up and you're just like out of it eight hours sleeping my schedule becomes even worse <laughs> 57 alarms and hope one of them wakes you up you have a 23 percent chance success rate <laughs> very exact poor mike it was really bad the poor guy he he put up with it he's like i know that you're just you're just you're, you're cranky, <laughs> for lack of a better word. But I did end up selling- Horse, did you just try to eat my fence? I did end up selling, um, selling my turnips. And I'm glad Titus opened his gate because he had really good prices. <laughs> and Titus is awesome, so. Oh yeah, no, we can definitely laugh about it now. Out of the two of us, Mike is usually the one who gets, like, hangry or cranky or whatever you want to call it, so... The odd time I do isn't really... ...too bad. I have a ton now, I try not to nap, because... Or, but instead you have a solid sleep schedule. I'm, uh... I'm pretty good about, like going to bed at a decent time, sleeping pretty well, but I'm, I'm worried because my mom was the same way. And these days she doesn't get more than like four or five hours usually. She just, she's a night owl. Um, and she's up early in the morning, even though she's retired, she does not have to go anywhere, you know. Uh, she just, she doesn't sleep well and I hope that that doesn't happen to me. 
So it kind of developed with age with her. I need to apologize for snapping when I was hangry, cranky. Yep. <laughs> Look at what the headache after. What is sleep? <laughs> hey, lemongrass, how are you doing? Back uh, to work in a week's time. I'm going later in this week to uh, to help change in winter stock. The spring summer? That's awesome. I'm glad that you got it, you know, sorted before work. Slept too long. <laughs> Try to go to bed on time, but my anxiety sometimes makes it hard to sleep. Yep. Yep. It's annoying when you're tired and you're laying there, but you can't shut off your brain. I get it. And I was struggling to conform and exist in a world made for morning people. So Mike and I actually had this conversation a while ago. It's far-fetched. But I was saying, wouldn't it be kind of neat? If we had a daytime, I don't know how to put this, like a daytime civilization and a nighttime civilization. Oh my god, there are so many spiders in here. We're also having a bad luck day, so that might be why. Um, so like literally there was, you know, your normal jobs people did during the day and then there was people who would cover and do it at night. Um, so you could go out and go out two in the morning if that was your if that's your schedule but uh we need a lot of stuff to to be able to do that like better lighting and stuff uh for outside even in the city here like it, it still gets dark right but i don't know i think it'd be kind of handy I'm not, I'm not a nighttime person usually but i know a lot of people who are uh mike he he works night shifts right now and he, it just it works for him and they can like jump over rocks and everything too they're just like in your face we're like 5 a.m to 1 p.m sleep schedule past year so it's nice to see sunlight again yeah Our staircase almost didn't see it there kind of blends in a bit I don't think I've seen these stick enemies big morning person I can't imagine what it be, must be like to be a night person nothing beats a slow morning cup of coffee and watching the sunrise yeah I'm definitely more of a morning person as well or just like daytime in general I see no point in staying up personally Don't think you're either? That's fair. Okay, more spider friends. Gosh, try it. <laughs> no, stop it. There we go. Hard to keep in touch with people in North America, yeah, because it's a decent uh, time gap. Okay, there we go. Oh, there's so many spiders on this floor. <laughs> That's okay, we're getting a decent amount of coal, so... Oh my god. Alright, we're, we're fine, we're fine. This is fine. Just keep swinging. Just keep swinging. It's like Dory, but just keep swinging instead of swimming. I'd love to come through here on multiplayer with someone. Okay. Uh, so if it's morning or night, nighttime person, some days I'll fall asleep at 9 p.m. And other days my room will keep me up until 3 a.m. or all night. Yeah. 
uh being a night owl though i think something like being more ambient peaceful and just less noise and people yeah yeah oh there's more okay, i'm very surprised i haven't found stairs yet with the amount of you guys i'm going through Recently, though, I've been doing a thing where I pretty much have to eat my food before 6 in the evening. Like, that is cutoff time, and then after that I just have water. And I found it helps me sleep a lot better. Maybe because I've already digested my food by the time I go to sleep, or... Um... Because I'm not, like, boredom eating. But it's been... it's been really good for me to, uh... Kind of have, like, a cutoff point, almost. And I have definitely noticed a difference in my... Um, I sleep, how rested I feel. Get bit to bed. Uh, I'm a very light sleeper, yep. Yeah. Southern fried chicken in the oven at 2 a.m. <laughs> See, that sounds amazing. But, I don't know, I don't think I could go back to eating late. I used to just like, you know, eat a tub of ice cream before bed with Mike. I've been trying not to do that. Ooh, another green gem. Partly the daylight. Oh yeah, they definitely do get stuck in the, in the cobwebs. That's really cool. Definitely don't think we're gonna get down that far today. We're just not having all that great luck. No, you don't want to give me a staircase? No? I see how it is. Oh, there's my staircase. All right, 60, 65. We'll see if we can make 70. I kind of feel like that might not happen. But we're doing good. We have four, three days tomorrow. That might be pushing it a bit. <laughs> I don't know how, how well you guys can hear it, but uh, I like the... Usually I, I like more music in my Stardew saves, or games, um, so I have the more music mod. But this has actually been really nice. Um, just having like the ambient sounds. Oh wait a minute. Stairs. Okay, I have some more. Oh, too nausea to eat? What is that? Okay, it's only gonna last for another minute and a half. <laughs> I just have to survive. I was wondering why I was still flashing green. That's evil. Freaky sir, enjoy your evening walk. We'll see you later. I doubt ginger. Oh, you know what? That's really neat that that's what helps with that. That's really cool.
I think out of everything. <laughs> Three more floors, that's all we need. Imagine going on walks. <laughs> I'm hoping the weather here gets better so I can go back out again. Is it still going? Oh, okay, good. A couple more seconds here. Wait for it. There we go. Is it sunnyish outside for you? It uh, it feels pretty cold. Unfortunately, I haven't checked the temperature today, but it might be nice enough to put on a hoodie and go out. Uh, Quinton, oh, hello. How's it going? Welcome back. I hope things are going good for you today. Come on game, I really want to get down these last floors. It feels like it should have something in there. One more floor here. Guess to come pick up a package. It's nerve wracking. Oh no. <laughs> Gonna lurk a bit while I do some art. That sounds like a plan. Enjoy. I uh, have a little bit of artwork I need to be doing myself later on today for um, something for Club Tortimer. And we'll see how, uh, how that goes. Get a haircut in the next few days. Give myself a DIY. DIY, sorry, DIY one like a month or so ago, and it was a choice. <laughs> I like how you usually say it was a choice. Not a good or bad one, just a choice. <laughs> If I pass out, I just let me get to floor 70. That's that's the main thing. I know, 1 a.m., 1 a.m., I know. Ooh, diamonds. Nice. Probably not gonna make it. That's so, so unfortunate. Gosh darn it. Oh. Making a stairwell would have been a good idea. Yeah, I saw that at the last minute. Okay, so we have to go from 65 tomorrow. I also don't know how many... How many stones does a stairwell take? I've never actually made one, I don't think. Oh well. That's okay. That's okay. Or so yeah, no one was doing 69 jokes when I was on that floor. Disappointment, chat. <laughs> what were you guys thinking? I was tempted. <laughs> okay. Okay, that's fun. Very nice stone for one stairwell, but it's Friday, so you can trade them in the desert for jades. Oh yeah, true. Okay, 
let's go take care of our morning stuff and then we'll go back into the mines <laughs> and we're having a good luck day so hopefully we'll fly down a bit faster I, uh, I saw what, how much stone we had, though. We had 74. I wouldn't have been able to make one anyway. We're mature. <laughs> Can't relate to that. coffee in here and that can go in there too. Um, we'll sell off the other stuff. How are Ollie and Kiara doing? They're both doing good. Together, not so good. Separately, they're they're really good. <laughs> um, Ollie is still uh, scared of Kiara to the point of aggression, so... Uh, it's been a bit of a process trying to get them to realize that they're, you know, making it harder on themselves. Yeah, I'm hoping one day, like, I, I'm not asking for them to be BFFs or anything or be all snuggly, but just, like, ignore each other, coexist, ignore, you know. Hey, Andrew, how's it going? Cat parenthood, I wish the same for my two cats. Yeah, it's, it's unfortunate because I purposely looked for a cat who was friendly with other cats. That was... What I was looking for. That was my, my big criteria when I was adopting Ollie, and I get the impression, unfortunately, that the person who we adopted him from didn't really know him all that well, hadn't had him for very long, because she also said that he didn't like wet food, and that is his favorite thing in the world. So, <laughs> um, I think he went very quickly from being in the vet uh, from his accident to being with this foster mom who didn't have the time to get to know him. There we go. Ooh. Um, Cause like, I know Kiara could be friendly with cats. She loved Tiger. She got on somewhat decently with the others. <laughs> um, I definitely wanted someone who was similar in that regard. sell off some wine today. I I do have enough money and the resources to buy another obelisk, but I'm kind of putting it off because I'm so focused on doing this quest. So at some point we will do it, just, <laughs> just bear with. Okay, placement, placement over efficiency, yeah! No, I know that if you upgrade your, your shed you can have more kegs, obviously. Probably better efficiency, but um, because I'm using controller as well, it's a lot easier for me to have it laid out like that. There we go, got another rabbit's foot. No, hard boiled. <laughs> Why must you guys sit right there? So 65 onwards, maybe I'll bring some stone with me just so I can make a set of stairs if we run into that situation again, because that was really, really bad. There we 
There we go. Just, just in case. <laughs> Okay, we can do this. We're having a good luck day. Hopefully the stairs make themselves known a little bit faster. Oh, nice. There we go. 67. Okay, this was the crazy floor. <laughs> Oh, 68. This is so much better. It was just bad luck yesterday. Did anyone in here ever play the MMO Ion or Aeon? A I O N? Out of curiosity. Oh, there's some more of that iridium, or not iridium, what's it called? Radioactive stuff? The reason why I ask is in that game, one of the creatures that you can have as a pet, as well as some of the NPCs seem to have as pets, from what I remember, is these like little mushroom friends. And they were really cute. And the mushrooms in here remind me of it. You did play it as well? I really enjoyed that game. Go away. Go on, shoot. Never heard of it? Oh, I really liked it. It was a free-to-play one. Uh, really, really pretty graphics. Ooh, okay, Floor 70. <laughs> when was it released? I was playing it in 20, 2013, it would have been, I think. Um, I don't know what year it came out, but that was around the time I was playing it. I'm going to old school when it comes to MMOs. Yeah, that's fair. I think I had a cape. That was fancy. Uh, I think Ion was actually like my first, my first MMO, 29 or 2009 worldwide. I think 2008 in Asia. Yeah, that does sound probably about right. Um, so like whenever I play a different MMO, I'm always going to compare it to that one. Just my first experience with it. Good. We're doing, we're doing a lot better. Hey, Tatterfell, how are you doing today? Welcome back. Just, you're not allowed to hit me like that. Go away. Okay, 75. story. <laughs> I looked over and I'm like, what on earth is that noise? Oh, we got the cool sunglass slimes again. Okay, back to these floors. Entirely. There we go. 78. 
Let's see how it. Keep having a great time. Thanks as always for the great vibes. Cowgirl, we'll see you later. Thank you so much for stopping by today. I hope you have a good rest of your day. I was also thinking, you guys, uh, Pokemon Snap is coming up on us very quickly here. I'm thinking maybe in the Discord we could have a Pokemon Snap section. Of course, it would have to be like one of those, like, you know, click at your own wrist sort of things because it's, you know, people aren't going to want to see everything right away, I'm assuming. Uh, but maybe we could, like, share our, our pictures in there and such. So I know there's, like, online ranking, but, like, you know. Yeah, yeah, I think that sounds like fun. are connected. <laughs> Ooh, is this gonna be like mushroom lava floors? Ooh, what are you? Oh, you have a bow and arrow. That's cool. That's kind of neat. All right, let's keep pick up gold while we're in here. Forming on my new island. Now I don't know what to do with it. That's a mood. Maybe take some time, think on it. Use an island planner, maybe. If you don't want to, like, you don't know, actually start, but you still want to see what you might be able to do. Wait, is that a. Oh, it's a gold orb, but it's a crab. What's that? Oh, I got another one of those rings. <laughs> an enricher? Place on a sprinkler. Oh! Automatically uh, apply it when planting seeds nearby. These are one of the things we can buy from the key quests, actually. That's really neat that you can find them in here. Okay, let's aim for 85, maybe. Plan down or go with what I've got. You know what? My, my gut option, or my gut opinions. Go with what you got. Flatten, like, as needed. Just because it's, it's hard to get things looking even relatively natural again after I found. I was just supposed to arrive today, but according to the website, it's still in Tennessee. Oh, that's annoying. Hopefully those come in. Sure, my third tier of plus, I feel a lot better about my island now. It just feels more spacious. Yeah, the third tier is a little bit... A little bit weird, I agree. As it is with my new town, I'm kind of like, I don't know, I, I want to use all the tiers, but I don't have ideas for all of them, so I'm just thinking of sticking with tier 1 and tier 2. Uh, I'll just get rid of that. For a bit, I got a copy and wrote down the different bundles for the community center. Uh, so I forgot the pantry fish tank and craft room unlocked, so I got a bit to go. Uh, watching stream while running to the community center sounds good, sounds good. I think it's really handy to have a list of what you need for the community center. Okay, 85. That's where we're gonna call it for today, that's pretty good. So we have... two days to go down. 35 levels, am I counting that right? I think that should be manageable. Why am I going this way? <laughs> I just hope we have good luck days. That's the only thing. If we're having bad luck, then uh, getting down that is a lot harder. Okay, 
So I got some new stone stuff. Um, I'll put the enricher in here. I don't really know if I'm going to use that, but handy nonetheless. And we got these, and I got another one of these rings. Always seem to find their way back to me. Hey again, Projector. How's it going? Welcome back. Man, I'm I'm not used to selling stuff mid-season, and I'm actually surprised at how much we make per day. We we usually make quite a bit. So the mine repairing a few fences. Okay, hopefully those don't break this time, because that's what happened after she did it last time. Want to hear a sunny story? Always. If you guys have any pet stories in general to tell me. I love hearing and talking about and seeing pets, so. Today, let's grab our scythe. Our banana tree is fully grown too, so we're gonna actually let that get to three bananas, and then we'll come back in for that one. On lunch break, sounds good. Uh, so yeah, these and these can go in there. And I think we'll put this other bundle in this chest and we'll just try to... There we go, split it between the chests. Someone we have. We're married to Penny in the save file. We have two kids. Um, it's my first time having kids in Stardew, actually, so. Rotisserie, rotisserie chicken. There we go. Sorry. At our grocery store, if we go on lunchtime, which we did today, so time finished his plate and there was only a bone left. When he got to put his plate away, he realized that the bone was not there anymore. He looked at Sunny and she was licking her mouth. We searched a little bit and we don't know where the bone is. Okay. That's concerning for sure, just in case it's like. A smaller or sharp bone. Definitely keep an eye on her. Or steal it, but yeah, I'm really concerned because of that reason. Yeah, definitely have a really, really good look around. Um, because like even if she didn't get it and it fell somehow, she could still find it. Oh, you're gonna marry Shade. That's awesome. I hope you uh enjoy being married to him. I've only ever married Penny and uh Sebastian before. Into the mines. 
We're on floor 85, we need to get down to floor 120, and we have two days to do it, today and tomorrow. Um, I think we can do it, as long as tomorrow's not like a really bad luck day or anything. Jackson. Okay, good. Yes, give me more bombs. <laughs> you could do this. Thank you. Appreciate the confidence. <laughs> Spike there if I ever saw one. Muffin Izzy, hello, how's it going? No worries. Oh, good. I hope you're having a good one. And, uh, welcome on in. Okay, let's get to the bottom, shall we? There we go. 87. Staircase, that's good. Eighty-eight. I'm really curious to see what's at like the very bottom of this, I have to admit. Like if there's anything different. I'm gonna assume there must be something going on down there. the harder mines. These are the normal mines, actually. It's just that they look different because of a quest right now. Uh-oh. Alright, we're gonna have some bad friends. Sketchy there. Are, are you not gonna drop a staircase? No, really? Alright. I see how it is. On game we were doing so okay, there we go. We we're doing so good. Okay, a lot of enemies over here. So many of you friendos over here. Jesus. A lifesaver. Unless you're lactose intolerant. <laughs> now, ooh, did that make everything darker? That's kind of neat. It does make everything darker. That's that's a really cool uh, thing. We got a squid on you right for a second there. <laughs> that wouldn't have been so fun. I do miss my fish. I do miss my uh, my blobfish mask. <laughs> 
There we go. 94. Vera was born. Those guys definitely drop bombs at a nice rate, because I've been getting uh, quite a few back here. Let's eat something. close to where we should be. <laughs> Ooh, you're new. What are you? Oh, you have sunglasses on. You're really cool. What's up the sky? <laughs> I mean, are you outside right now? Is that, is that how the sky's up there, or... Uh... ceiling be first. Classic. <laughs> uh, I think I'll go for my nap. No worries, Rosie. We'll see you later. Enjoy your nap. Okay. Nearly there. Oh god, okay. I'm not even gonna bother. Wrong answer. Uh-oh. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so this 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 is one of those spiral floors. We want to find this as fast as possible. Hydrate, I got you. Thank you. I haven't actually been doing that nearly as much as I should have been. Melissa, have a good day at work. We'll see you later. I just got a ice cream from a chest. This is usually something that would happen in Nino Kuni. Okay, floor 100. <laughs> Let's keep going. The more we can get done today, the better, just in case it's a bad luck day tomorrow. Where you get a roast chicken by breaking walls. I've never played a Castlevania, but I'm here for that. <laughs> there we go. Ooh, this, those guys are dropping some really good stuff. Stay away. You had that hydrate reminder too. Yeah, there you go. That's why we like to hear lots of hydrating. Oh, wait, I see our stairs. Uh -huh. Alright, one more floor, and I will feel comfortable finishing the last 15 tomorrow, hopefully. That was a pretty good run through. We went from 85 to 105. That's... And we... <laughs> I think we came out with more bombs than when we went in. So I'll take that. I saw a really cute Reddit post of someone who made like a little horse stall um, for when they're when they're in the in the mines. Um, and like their horse just hangs out. Hey, Silver Palm, how's it going? I hope you're having a good day. Overall, productive day. <laughs> oh, you know what? I just realized I could technically go get my obelisk right now. Uh, what do I need for that again? I guess we could just go check. We'll 
figure out which one we want. Because uh, we definitely have the money for it. Okay, something about the blah, blah, blah emote and then the hyper Elmo below it. It just... <laughs> it looks like Elmo's punching it in the tongue. <laughs> My most boring skill in RuneScape and have been for the past three days. Oh no. I hope that you, uh, you know, beyond the stream, you have something good to put on off to the side. Maybe something like a podcast to listen to. That's usually what I end up doing. Okay. So. Works you to the mountains? Works you to the beach? And that's all. We have mountains or beach. Which one do you guys think we should go for? Held a whole bag of Cadbury chocolate orange buttons. Oops. <laughs> that sounds really yummy though. Um, I don't really, like, I'm kind of indifferent. You say mountains? Mountains? Yeah, I guess for going to Robins, it might be handy as well. Um, so we need 10 iridium bars and 10 earth crystals. Mountains are super close as well, but we also have shortcuts everywhere too. Honestly, I just kind of want to get them all. <laughs> it's literally, I don't know how often I'll be using them. Like the island one and the desert one, yeah, you know, handy. The other ones, it's the shortcuts. It's really neat. You think you'd go with beach as well? What was the beach one needed again? Or like, what did it need? Because I don't remember. I just know I needed these and this. Oh, but you haven't seen them. I actually found one like a stream later. Like I, I totally didn't miss it or totally didn't see. Uh, was it coral? Was there something else? I feel like there was something else there. Coral and clams. Okay, well, let's bring everything. And the iridium again, which we have. Because, like, for the most part, I don't go down to the beach a lot anymore. I kind of just minecart everywhere. <laughs> oh, it's only five iridium bars for it then. Interesting. Don't mind me, just breaking into your house at midnight, it's all good. Uh, so earth and the beach one, yeah, um... This is technically further away, and it's more annoying to get to if I need to for whatever reason. Yeah, why not? It doesn't really matter. We're gonna have enough funds to make the other one really quickly anyway. If how fast we've made money this stream is any indication. How much space do I have between these ones? I think I had just a space. There we go. We're pretty much back down to the money I think we started stream with today. <laughs> so that's not bad per se. Ooh, I think it might rain. I just looked out the window and it's like super cloudy again. I did the same thing yesterday. I started off nice and then it went kind of gray and dreary. Brandon, just the one. Just the one, actually. After that, the big thing that we're going for is the golden clock, I think. And that one's very, very pricey. I do want the return scepter. I don't actually remember... How do you go about getting that? I'm not gonna lie. Um, I just remember it being a thing. Is that Krobus? Okay. Is that more or less expensive than the, um... Uh... Golden Clock? Two million. How much is the gold? Is it ten? I know it's pricey. Yeah, that's not too bad. That's not too bad. We can we can get that. It'll take a while, but we can do it. Clock is 10 mil. Okay, yeah, so we'll get the return scepter first. Thank you for reminding me. That'd definitely be handy. 
Grandeur sounds lovely. Yeah, no, I think it's it's more of a priority over the clock for sure. The clock is just like the big, the big thing. <laughs> Oh, she made me omelets, heck yeah. Pick up, pick up the coffee, there we go. I'm gonna put that in the fridge for now because I'm not hungry at the moment. And then the omelets, especially after 1.5, I get the little warp totem so often from the mines. Yeah, looking back on it, like I completely forgot about the existence of the warp, or uh, the return scepter until you mentioned it. It would have been really handy. Okay, tomorrow's the night market. So we want to go to that for sure, because that's where we get our blobfish. <laughs> and we need a couple of them for making masks for my family. Because that's a priority. Renee wants to move after time traveling to November last year. Oh my goodness, very nice. I said it last stream, you guys, but I've never had the warp totems or the obelisks, sorry, before. Um, I'm feeling very accomplished and proud. <laughs> I never really stick around with the save file for this long either. I usually go until about year three, get grandpa's evaluation, and like that's it. weird anyone else out that the ostrich is in with the barn. I know it's a bigger animal, but like it literally lays eggs. It should be in the coop. <laughs> yeah, that's the ostrich noise. It's weird, isn't it? Oh yeah, true, the door. You're absolutely right. I didn't even think about that. <laughs> oh, one of my cats is meowing. No, nope, no, that's the that's the ostrich. <laughs> Kiara is she is snoring beside me, but I think she tired herself out from all the uh, chaos this morning. Final day in the mines, hopefully. I mean, it, you know, it's today or never. It's our last day to do this, so. I shouldn't have been so close to that. There we go, there's another key uh, thing. that radioactive stuff on that floor. I wanted that. <laughs> Whoopsie. Does not feel like 2 p.m. Yeah, streams have gone by pretty pretty quickly. I've been very focused though for today's stream. Oh, and I have a lot of work to do after stream today too, but it's all work I like doing, so I don't really mind. Ooh, the game actually lagged from that explosion. <laughs> Also, I just noticed we're having a good luck day, so hopefully that makes getting through here a bit easier. Okay, there we 
go, stairs. go I was trying to hit them with my pickaxe okay floor floor 110 10 more 10 more and we are we are through this quest I wonder what I haven't actually like I don't know what I want to buy next from the the key quest rewards so I'll have to decide eat the cheese I'm gonna have so many bat wings by the end of this. There we go. Is that there's skulls in the wall in here? It's minorly concerning. I kind of, I'm not gonna lie, after playing Story Seasons, I'm very used to like being able to charge up my pickaxe or my hammer and hit multiple rocks. Ah, uh, Jackson, not normally, at least not from what I remember. I just remember it being very fiery. So maybe it was. They're going really, really good. We're nearly down to the bottom. Um, and I'm, I'm very, very excited to see what's down here. If, you know, if anything, maybe it's just, you know, floor 120 and it's just like, yeah, you did it. <laughs> okay, that was an easy floor. Do my SNH layout, but I'm kind of torn on how to do my. Well, thank you so much for the follow. How to do my neighborhoods? I want to ask you if you prefer two bigger neighborhoods, three houses each, or three smaller ones. I'd say three. If you do the three houses each one, you're gonna run into one where it's not even, right? Because there's ten villagers normally. I do the two villagers each one personally, and like maybe villagers who you think would get along well would be a good idea. We ever actually got to the bottom yet? I remember my first playthrough, I really had trouble. I, I kept dying on floor 19. <laughs> I ever have three and some have two. Yeah, I know personally the uneven numbers would get to me. Uh, that's why usually if I have a neighborhood, I like to keep them like all together, all ten. But that takes up a lot of space, obviously. Um, except in the Stardew layout for Lily Bell, obviously I couldn't do that. Okay, one more floor, one more floor, and we are to the bottom in a week.
Oh, is my inventory full? Uh oh. Okay, I don't need two of those. Grab me some mushrooms here. Are you not gonna want me to find the last staircase? Is that how it's gonna be, game? I have a feeling that's how it's gonna be. Let's see. There we go. All right, floor 120. That looks new. We got our, uh, I think it was 40 or 50 uh, gems. That's great, we have 90 now. What's this? There's a note from Mr. Key. I've temporarily disabled this shrine. Come back tomorrow. Ah, okay. Okay, wait, 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 wait. If I come back tomorrow, that's today's the last day of the quest. Does this stay? Does anyone know? Because. I don't want to like miss out on something because I finished it on the last day. You're now worthy and then you turn blue. Oh no. Only one way to find out. Yeah, I guess we don't have much of a choice. Two bigger ones or three smaller ones. Both heads up to six villagers. That's fair. These all the way. How much coal did I get from that run? We got a decent amount of coal. We got a little bit of gold. Um, I could make bars with this now. Give that a try. Just two, but I can do it. Um, and why don't we put more iridium in while we're doing this. Ollie must do stand right there. Okay, we'll also put those away. Um, this goes up here. That was quite a quest though. <laughs> that was like on par stressful with the uh, gift everyone 50 loved presents one. Because it, it just takes up so much time. Okay, let's go see what rewards we can get and we can decide what we wanna, what we wanna do here. Jackson. We'll see you later. Thank you so much for hanging out. How are these doing? Are these fully done? They're looking fully done. Yeah, nice. Okay, I'm one's down here. It's not done, but that's okay. Just in seven hardwood. Get the craft room done, but there's no stumps on your farm. Oh, I mean, you can always. I don't know if you if you know about the secret woods, but. That could be an option. Alrighty, so we have 90 to spend. We already have the horse flute. Uh, the missing stock list I heard is very handy. Yeah, there's a secret woods that you can get into. Uh, kind of close to the wizard's tower and you can get more hardwood from there. Uh, pressure nozzle. See, this is- I could buy one of those as well as the Pierre stock list and start stockpiling those. I forgot that you can buy those. <laughs> uh, so yeah, I think I'm gonna go for the stock list because I heard that this is very good. So I think we have to give that to him and I'm also gonna get a galaxy soul. We need three of them.
There's a quest you can do where you can find them as a drop. Really? Oh gosh darn it. <laughs> That's okay, thank you for letting me know. Um, I'll just have the one then. And you never know, maybe I'll be able to get more. Man, my headphones are really doing a number on my ear today. It's really annoying. This this headset I'm wearing is currently like the best one I've ever found. It's super lightweight. It doesn't really, you know, hurt to wear usually for long periods, but every now and then it just sits funny on my ear and it hurts. I only got one from that way, so I still have to buy the other two. Okay. So we'll see. I probably should have just grabbed my tractor. Um, we might get lucky and find them. Doesn't look like weight. Oh no, they're super lightweight. You want to see bulky, actually. Give me a second. These. <laughs> These are the heavy ones that I wear off stream. These I can't wear for more than like an hour at a time. They're comfy. They're very plush, but they are heavy. <laughs> yeah. These. These are lightweight in comparison. Hey, Risa, how's it going? Welcome on in. I hope you're having a good day. Uh, we just did kind of a fun key quest in game, and uh, I just stopped over on the island to get my rewards from it, so. Okay, we're just probably gonna sell those. Apples, are you making pizza? Oh no. <laughs> oh dear lord, no. We start to have to like five minutes. Yeah, it's only this year. It's really annoying. Um, some days I can wear this headset all day, like literally full stream after stream before stream, no issues. And then some days it just it like sits funny almost. Like I swear my head's a different shape from day to day. <laughs> When I first started streaming, though, I actually used to um, purposely wear earbuds for that reason, just because it was annoying to wear headphones the entire time. Oh god. <laughs> oh, okay, that was a little bit scary. $7 earbuds are much more comfortable than my AirPods. That's really weird, but it's good though, right? One's a lot cheaper to, re to replace than the other. Headset one working, but it starts to hurt my head after all. But for a while, it's earbuds, yeah. Um, I had a... Uh... I went through a couple of actually different pairs of Logitech headphones that like I really liked and they sounded great, but they're so obnoxious to wear. Unfortunately. Ooh, so there's the radioactive bars. They look really cool. Ever really so I have to have headphones. Yeah, all day, yeah. So let's put this in here for now. I have no clue what song this is. I think it's one of Emily's. Or... Maybe... Sam's band? Don't know what that was, but... <laughs> I, uh, high energy. Working a straight during stream, my Bluetooth ones. Also starting to act up, so I gotta get two new pairs now. Oh, that's the worst. Is that Emily's dancing song? No. Put in? Oh, this is- I'm- You guys didn't see that. I wasn't trying to put a seed in there. There we go. <laughs> So finally I don't feel like I have to rush off to the mines, which is great. Although I do want to see if there's anything at the bottom now. Oops. 
sí. And those, and there we go. I like how I complained that it was getting all cloudy and all of a sudden the sun starts coming in and messing up my camera. Over the head, uh, headphones because they hurt my head, but I love earbuds. So I have a pair for my PC, but I have a Bluetooth one that does... Uh, goes around the back of your head. So nothing dangles. Yeah, having a wire. Yeah, I've seen those before. I have a Bluetooth pair that I wear when I go out for my walks, but... Um, I pretty much use these to monitor not only, um, you know, the sounds you guys hear on stream, but I also use it to monitor my own voice. So I can hear myself through the microphone. Um, and, like, noise cancelling especially, not being able to hear yourself, it drives me up a wall. I can't stand it, so... I hate the idea that I might be just yelling at someone. The, the alpaca's noise is still top tier, I think, but it is pretty funny, yeah. I can touch my laptop one, can I do my switch? Alrighty. Uh, let's go hand in this thing. I think I have to bring this to Pierre? Yeah. And then, um... Let's see what's at the bottom of the mine. If anything, it's probably nothing. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you know. Thank you so much for that follow, I appreciate that. Pierre, I got something for you. Oh wow, it's my old stock list! I've been searching everywhere for this thing. Let me see, yep, it's all still here. With these order codes, I can expand my stock to include seeds from all seasons year-round. So that kind of negates the use of the, the night market somewhat, in my opinion. It's still a cool event, mind you. So, you can see we can buy spring stuff. Summer stuff, fall stuff, all year round, which is kind of cool. Actually, quiet. Let's try and actively be loud, yeah. How does these are more expensive though? That's good to know. That's good to know. I'm not too, too fussed about money at this point, and for the most part, I've been using the seed maker, so I haven't really bought from Pierre in a while. The key steal it from him, honestly, would not surprise me. Would not surprise me. He just, like, acquired it somehow. <laughs> Sold it back to you so you could give it back to Pierre. Shrine of Challenge. Dispel the ancient magis mag magi seal of protection, allowing powerful monsters to ascend from the... No, that sounds like a horrible idea. <laughs> no. What is that? <laughs> so, did someone, someone actually tell me what that is? Do the crops out of season? Ooh, that's an interesting idea that they sell more out of season. Well, we probably would have noticed that from the... Like, the island and the, um... Greenhouse, right? Oh, it makes them stay in that... Oh, okay, so we can go back anytime we want. That's cool. Because I liked floor 40. That was a really pretty floor. <laughs> okay. Uh, and next thing... Let's go see, uh, let's go see what he has this week in terms of challenges. That was a pretty tough one, so I'm definitely not doing that again anytime soon, but... Do we need to hold on to any mineral minerals or artifacts we find that we don't need? As long as you've already donated to the museum, I usually just sell it, personally. Gems and stuff I keep, but... Okay, so Danger in the Deep is back, and Extended Family is back. I don't know if I'm ready for the fish to be sassy to me again, but I kind of do want the, uh, the key token things. I don't know. Meh. I don't want 
to go fishing suddenly. <laughs> I didn't have any luck with it last time. Okay, well, if we're gonna go fishing, uh, may as well do it the right way. Um, Do I have more bug meat than that? Oh, really, Andrew? That's good to know. I usually, like, I have set things I give the villagers, and I don't ever, like, deviate from it. If that makes sense. Alright, so we're not having, like, the best luck day today, unfortunately, for fishing. Um... But we can give it a try. Push it for fish ponds too, so that's something to keep in mind if you're interested in the fish ponds. Another thing I don't really do, so that's that's good to know also. There we go, sorry. Getting my little notification thing to stop uh, moving. Actually, what do you got? Experiment with tropical cooking, but it's hard to find any ingredients. If someone could ship 100 tarot roots. Uh... I mean, if we're gonna be fishing, we may as well be fishing, right? <laughs> How much do you need? Oh, right. Yeah, that sounds like a lot of work. We could do it, though. Uh, I'm probably gonna be asking you guys where to find those, though. Thingy for sprinkler in winter, like, thanks. I think. <laughs> it was like, yeah, here you go. I mean, I do have a lot of sprinklers set up elsewhere, at least, but it is kind of funny. I'm gonna try and close this a bit. There we go. Not perfect, but better, at least. I still haven't seen. I haven't really fished up any like cool weapons. I I have had save files where like I got like the Neptune sword and the trident and stuff super quickly, but not not this one. do some damage when whipping that sea cucumber around. I probably could. Good thing no one was behind me when I was casting it in. Yeah, I think they are too, Andrew. I think they are too. Um, I, I know I've heard where to catch the stingrays before, but I can't actually remember. But I've definitely heard that before. <laughs> actually, how many days do I have to do that one? Okay, we have- we have a week. So, I want to focus on this one first since it's only three days. Yeah, and some of these fish can be incredibly annoying. Yeah, glacier fish. I'm not looking forward to that again. That was, uh... I could go to, like, three minutes of me mashing the X button. <laughs> and, uh, ignoring everything else. Which am I looking for? I'm looking for the cousin to the crimson fish. Which, so far, I don't think I've so much as run across it. Mm -hmm. 
It's annoying because I know I have this Crimson Fish Junior or whatever it's called in a chest right now on my farm, but I can't use it. How can a fish have a cousin? I don't know, don't ask me. I don't know. Actually, wait a minute, maybe I should check that. Is it cousin? Uh, so we have Mrs. Angler, Glacierfish Jr., son of Crimson Fish is the son, my apologies. Just straight up radioactive carp, and the legend, the second. That's who we're looking for. Hydrate, thank you. Ooh, we got diamond, nice. I'll take that. Yeah, I, I've done this quest, I think this is the third time now, so I, I know where to catch them all, it's just some days I just don't have good luck with this at all. Let's see. Also, the night market's open. And I really want to get the blobfish. So maybe we should go there. Okay, we'll give it like a couple more casts, and then if not, we'll just try tomorrow and hope it's a good day. I love the night marmot, uh, marmot? market music too. <laughs> Son of a crimson fish. <laughs> oh goodness. cast come on you can you can do it come on out <laughs> oh there it is heard my warnings at least maybe maybe you might be something else that's kind of obnoxious so you're being really nice maybe you're not it oh no that was it okay it was just being nice to me that's great Notice like the neon mermaid sign on that boat. I've never like I've never really looked at it. Okay, I've been waiting ever since we put that mask on Boopsie. I've been waiting to go back in here and catch more. Bring her down. We need uh we need to have everyone in my family wearing these masks. <laughs> I remember when this first came out, this was like Mike and I's favorite thing to do. We'd like rush and be here like right away at five and then spend the entire time just down here and then like try to stay down as long as possible. I like that you can kind of see the creatures in the background as well. Oh, gosh darn it, I got anxious. one per mask, so I just need two here. Last time I'm going up down. Oh, really? Was there? That's cool. I don't think we ever knew about that. this to me. It'd be 
horrifying if suddenly you saw like a big fish go by in the background. Like, I mean, like massive. Anyone in here who's played Final Fantasy VII, uh, you may know of uh, Emerald Weapon <laughs> and how it just creeps along the ocean floor. That always scared me so badly. There we go. Okay, there's our second one. That's awesome. Um, but for anyone who doesn't know, Emerald Weapon is like this giant creature. Uh, it's kind of hard to describe. He doesn't really look like anything but a giant mech to me. And uh, after a certain point in the game, you can get a submarine and go down to the ocean floor. And he has certain locations where he'll spawn or he'll just kind of like swim around. And uh, if you hit him, he is one of the super bosses of the game. And usually you're not ready for that yet, so... Spider crab in your eyes not that long ago. No, ma'am. No, those are horrifying. <laughs> Crabs are just straight up spiders in water. You can't convince me otherwise. Okay, well, I, I guess I came down here to get the blobfish and I got them both, so. You're gonna hate unknown. <laughs> Uh, random in your, I'm assuming, spider crab army at this point. That's a lot of diving to get those. Okay, let's head back up. Crabs can be cute. I mean, I don't know. They're very little pinch, little pinches. <laughs> Risa, yeah, when I heard that yours is also named Unknown, I'm like, oh, what a coincidence. <laughs> Yeah, no, they don't have a crate or anything. They're just like, they just chill. I know, DIY. Have I actually visited your dream address random or did I just visit you in general? Because I know that I've seen your town on stream at one point. <laughs> Soon, TM. <laughs> Okay, so now I have a second one of those. Um, I can go away and... What's this curve the tarantula malls and a heck ton of spider crabs? Uh, I think, did you get your, your lava but not lava floor back yet, random? I know you mentioned it when we had more design slots unlocked. Actually, that's perfect. I don't want to sell those. I need those. Oh, you couldn't make it look right? It looks really good in New Leaf, so... Okay, where's... where'd that sewing machine go? It's 12.30 at night. I'm making my mask. Make me two. There we go. One for me, one for Beans when he's old enough. He will he will don the mask. <laughs> oh, I feel so much better. I'm back to being myself again. He's in here. There we go. <laughs> She's gonna wake up and just see this face looking at her. <laughs> oh jeez. I like the night market, it's fun. Not that mask. <laughs> Thank you. 
Alrighty, it is... Uh, I think it's slightly better luck than yesterday at least. Look, we match! <laughs> oh, beans, you're up. What are you doing? One day, you'll grow into it. Old blob family. See, I kind of feel bad putting it on Penny. But the kids are different. They take after me. I haven't checked on my wine in a while. Twenty-seven days, okay. I'm hoping, um, I guess tomorrow I'm able to chop down some more trees and, and make some more of those lights, because I do like how nice it all looks at nighttime. Are you done yet? Uh, no. Spire crabs don't count as company. <laughs> That's not a sentence I think I'd be reading, or I thought I'd be reading today, but... I'm all right with this. See, like, because the ostrich is in here, I have to bring over the egg to the coop, and it's just... Let me be lazy. <laughs> Let me be lazy. Why do I have to do the, uh, this extra step that I would do normally anyway? Ah. Although same could be argued for the the wool from the from the bunnies. to fishing. <laughs> Alright, um, I'm gonna bite the bullet and try to get the glacier fish. It's the worst one. It honestly is. Um, but I guess we'll see. Maybe the blobfish mask will help. Random- <laughs> Please don't be biting that. <laughs> you shouldn't you shouldn't be doing that. Oh, that it? Or are you that other what was that annoying one the other day? I think you're the annoying one. No, you're not, but you're still pretty annoying. <laughs> Found it. Stop that now, you stop that. Oh god, I'm gonna lose it. Oh, I bounced off the bottom. <laughs> Grant's his birthday. Oh, wait a minute, give me a second.
All right, there you go. You were annoying, but it wasn't so bad. Uh, apparently it's his birthday now. I'm able to go in his room. He's the first one I can go into. That's really awesome. Yeah, Sebastian's such a sweetheart too. What does the mask look like on the horse? I would put it on, but I don't think you can actually like fully take off the mask if you can't. Like if you put it on, um, like I'd have to replace it with another hat, and I don't really want to do that right now. <laughs> Eventually, I will though. Cool. See what we can do with the fence. Yeah. One too many coffees. Yep. It was literally just bouncing around. Okay. Blobfish fam. Heck yeah. Maybe I should go and... I was thinking, I, like, oh yeah, you know, I got all the masks I need, but maybe I should go down and just get more just in case. I want to turn anyone else into a blobfish. <laughs> My tractor. But yeah, no, if anyone knows how you can actually take a hat. I shouldn't talk while I'm doing this. Uh, a hat off a horse in this game? Let me know. Because I know that you can replace it with another hat, but I don't know if you can, like, outright take it off. Which is the part that bugs me. Hey, Bish, how's it going? I hope you're having a good one. There we go. Radioactive carp is nowhere near as bad as the glacier fish. Undertale music? Undertale music indeed. Yeah, we have some, uh, some mods on and uh, one of them adds in music where there would otherwise be silence. Uh, and sometimes Undertale music does play, yeah. Rizzy, hello, how's it going? I hope you're having a good one. The horse to remove the hat. The horse is currently wearing a second clip of put a new hat on. Okay, I'll science that maybe on a different save file here at some point then. super easy and last but not least I think it's just the legend right yeah okay nice <laughs> easy <laughs> if I put a mask on a horse that makes no sense says I mean you know I I may or may not have a witch's hat currently on my tractor so I can't really talk <laughs> being blah today oh I'm sorry about that hopefully um you have a better day tomorrow and a nice relaxing evening with me. Yeah, this shortcut, this is the one that like I hadn't actually seen um, until very recently. I think it was last last time I streamed this and I was just like, oh, <laughs> There's another one right there, and I didn't even notice. Okay, didn't think that was it. It was being a bit too nice. Two weird stuff being put on cars. That's fair. That's true. I mean, I am putting it on my baby, though. So, like... Again, I can't talk.
Winter music's just great. Is that it? Maybe? No? Hmm. No, it might not be. No. Not at all. Okay, fingers crossed, chat. <laughs> I really want to get this, this done, because I know if I pause later on for the day for stream and I come back tomorrow, I'm going to completely forget that I was working on this. I was expecting it to suddenly go up. I think. Oh yeah. go. Sorry, I focus so hardcore whenever I'm catching one of those. There we go. There's that quest done, so I think I'm just gonna sell all of these. We already have a tank full of each of them, so I have no reason to really keep them. Night market's open. Maybe we'll go tomorrow, I guess. Um, I guess it never hurts to have more blobfish masks in storage. Alright, and I'll take out the ones we have in here. Ooh, the legend one sells for a lot. That's really good. day. I'm happy with that. Love fish pond. See that? What? Did, that's a good idea. I just, I, do, I just really just like the fish ponds in this game for some reason. I just had this huge thing about them ever since they came out. Although I probably could find a place for it. So I think um, 
I'm gonna say this and I'm gonna break a fence or I'm gonna find broken fences. But last time we were having trouble because I think I installed the no decay mod on the fences after I put them down. So they decayed anyway. What are you doing standing in the dark? <laughs> Why are you like this? Actually, I mean, I'm like that, so I guess that's fair. Uh-oh. Wow, it's seven and you're just like booking it to bed. What what kid goes to bed on their own, promptly on time, without being told to? <laughs> My goodness. Okay, like 35k. No kid ever. Yeah, no. I know, I definitely didn't at that age. They're not kids, they're robots. I mean, they're blobfish, but like, you know. Maybe that's why. Maybe... The blobfish people really appreciate their sleep. <laughs> I don't know. Anyways, you guys, I am wrapping up here for the rest of the day. I do want to thank you all so very much for watching and for hanging out with us so today. Um, we had a couple of raids earlier. I'd love to pass on the love. If you guys want to hang out for just a second, let me see who's live. You never know, you might find a new favorite streamer. I found so many new people to watch through raiding or hosting with someone else, so. Uh, who's live? Who's doing? Who's doing what? Kim's playing some Minecraft. Minecraft's always pretty fun. Thank you guys for hanging out with me though today. I hope you all enjoyed the stream. If you guys want to copy down the raid message, it'd mean the world to me. It should be... Um... Give me a second. Do I have a raid message still? There it is. There's our raid message. Simply press raid. You do not have to use the emotes if you're not subbed. That's totally fine. Um, but if you guys would come on over with me, I would appreciate it. So uh, I'm going to be lurking in Kim's chat for however long she's live for today. And then uh, I have I have some work to do this afternoon. So we're going to go get started on that. Thank you guys so much for hanging out. I hope you enjoyed it and look forward to some more Stardew tomorrow. We'll see you guys all later.